Brooke Anderson here again with the story of a new mom, reality TV's Tara Jolette. Yeah, she is the star of Tara's Little Family. She and her fiance Joe just had a baby girl, and I paid them a visit at home. I love that you're holding her. I can't cute. stop holding her. <laughs> She's so small sweet. in ever size people's arms, so though. I'm not used to it yet. How can we not be in love with sweet Penelope Charlevoix Ganafo? She was born just six weeks ago, weighing a healthy six pounds, two ounces. But because parents Tara and Joe are both little people, they've had to overcome major obstacles in the nursery to make sure the baby is safe. So tell me about the modifications you've made in the nursery. It's impossible to find a crib that actually fits a little person. Now that the ones that come down are outlawed, mm -hmm. this was honestly the only crib we could do. Without these barn kind of doors that open like that, there's just there's no way I'd be able to reach in to pick her up, up or even drop her off. Right. Joe's even locked me in just to make sure that the baby wouldn't be able to get out when she's older, like as a safety yeah. precaution. Oh, someone doesn't seem happy. She is not happy at all, huh? Penelope could grow to be Tara's size of four foot two and 90 pounds, and her future will be filled with lots of tests to check for any complications. She doesn't have any kind, any part of my dwarfism. It's all hers, and I've had like a bunch of leg surgeries and scoliosis and stuff. We're hoping that because she's just Tara's type, that she'll be able to avoid that. We don't know in the future if she's gonna need leg surgery or back surgery. All of these things are very common with achondroplasia, but all we can do is give her the best life that she can have. Do you hope to have more children? Yeah, we need to make a little boy protector for her. We need to <laughs> slow that train down. <laughs>